I can vouch for IPOP. They are not behind the attacks in Igbo land. Ipirbe makes it clear. You see, it only takes someone with lots of wisdom to be able to defend the Southeast. And it also takes someone with lots of transparent heart to be able to defend the Igbos. A Beribe is that man with a transparent heart. It is the same a Beribe that stood for Munam the Khan when he was arrested. Now he is making it clear to the Senate that IPOP knows nothing about the unnecessary attack they are talking about in the Southeast. Instead, they have been out to protect the people. Thank God for the Eastern Security Network. Southeast would have become a, a thing of the past. If not for the quick arrival of the Eastern Security Network, only God knows what would have become of the Eastern Security Network. Among all the leaders we have in the Southeast, it is only Senator Eberiboy. I will say that is free-minded and sincere. The rest are self-centered. Listen to uh, 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 what is his name? Nyam um, um, speak today. He was on top of his voice, crying that in that that there was never a time. He, he said that IPOP is behind the crisis in the southeast. He has forgotten. He has forgotten when he was in power, when he was reporting IPOP to the president and calling on the president to deploy military to dismiss IPOP out of the southeast. He has forgotten. He has forgotten how he connived with other Igbo leaders to take what belongs to the Igbo farmers and gave it to the Fulani headsmen. He has forgotten. In fact, Nya Umodo committed one of the highest atrocity. Nya Umodo. So there is no need being sympathetic with him. There is no need. So if he is saying what he is saying, he is saying it because he has seen the level IPOP is now and is afraid that they might come after him. He was believing that with President Mobari and because of the relationship that Nigerian government share with America, that IPOP will be completely wiped out. But as it is, he is ashamed of himself. That is why he is defending himself before the, the big tree falls on him, just like it fell on Kafarati. They should not worry. All of them will pay. They will pay because they cost pains to IPOP. They cost IPOP pain. Um, Wudu should stop denying because he knows so much and he has even joined hands in causing the death of many Biafrans. Many Biafrans. You get it. So what he's just saying, he's just saying to defend himself and to save himself many embarrassment. You understand? So my viewers, let me take you to the main content itself so that you get a true picture of what I'm talking about. The Senate Minority Leader and the Senator representing Abia State Senatorial Zone, Senator Enaya Eberibe, has once again spoken. Why speaking, Senator Eberibe made it clear that 
the proscribed indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, and other groups agitating for Biafra are not responsible for all the attacks in the southeast region. Senator Eberibe further stated that the attacks were being carried out by those he referred to as fifth columnists imported into Igbo land whose objectives was to destroy the Igbo land. According to the nation, Eberibe made it known after he delivered a keynote address at the NBA Oweri branch 2021 law week. He stated it clearly that those sponsoring the attacks just want to make the southeast region ungovernable. He went on and made it known that anyone who thinks that the IPOP or MASO are behind the insecurity situation in the southeast is making a big mistake. I really think that Senator Eberibe has spoken well. The people committing all these acts are not IPOP. But one thing is for sure, one day all these evil people must surely be exposed. Thank you for listening to this news. They know the people committing it. They know. They are just hiding under the guise of IPOP. They are hiding under the guise of IPOP. So that they will not... So, so that they will not be exposed. They know. Let us not give them that look. Let us not give them that look. Let us not give them the opportunity. They all know the people committing the crime. They are. They they all know. So they just give them name themselves that general name gunmen. So when they commit this crime, they have to refer it to IPOP. You see that? That's what they do. Well, I am happy that they are all realizing their mistakes. But then it's too late. Because IPOP has already gained all the trust that they need and support. Look at Majority of them are not demanding that Eastern Security Network should be a part and parcel of Ebebeago's security. What do they want to do with it? What are they going to do with it? And for what reason? Eh? For what reason? So my viewers, just like the first listener and commenter just said, Iberibe, Senator Iberibe has really spoken well. It shows that he knows the IPOP and he knows them in total. He knows their capability, what they are capable of doing and what they are not capable of doing. That is why he even went on to stand for Namdekan. Not minding what the world is saying or what the danger may call for. This is what we call a true leader. So whether they like it or not, whether they accept it or not, the truth has just been told and it has been revealed to those who truly care to know. Eberbe is the only leader that I know that can speak to Bari without fear. The rest are just following Bari like who is following a cow. <laughs> When the law of karma shall befall all of them, the one that befell Kaparati will be a child's play. Okay, let us hear from you anyway and know what you have to say about this that a baby has just revealed. If you are new on this channel, click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.